Hi YouTube, in today's video we have the latest Titan MSI Titan 18 inch, the 2025 model with Intel 285HX processor and the 5080 graphics RTX. I'm gonna show you how to disassemble this laptop to add more RAMs and SSDs. If you flip over the laptop, there are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 screws in total. They're all Phillip head screws, so you just need a regular Phillip head uh, screwdriver uh, to remove them and then you can take off the bottom panel after removing all those screws. Alright, once you removed all of the screws, it's time for us to remove the bottom panel using a plastic prying tool, something like this, thin and sharp. And I'm going to try to pry up from this corner right here. Yeah, slowly prying up the bottom panel from the laptop. The whole laptop. Oh. Okay. The whole, pro uh, the whole process of disassembling the bottom panel uh, for the Titan is pretty much similar as, uh, similar as the Asus SCAR-17. Uh, it's not, it's not... Okay, it's open. Okay, that's the internal of MSI Titan 18 inch for 2025 year. There's the battery right here, and I see one, two, three, four SSD slots. That's amazing. I've never seen a laptop that has four SSDs, and I heard the RAM slots are hidden underneath this metal panel. I guess this is the SSD 5, uh, the 5.0, like PCI Express, the latest and fastest uh, slot, this one, because it's got a heat sink right here, and rest of it, I think they're using PCIe Gen 4 and this one's Gen 5. Yeah, it actually printed on the um, motherboard. It says Gen 4, Gen 4, Gen 4, and right there, Gen 5. Let me close up. We have gigantic fans, just only two fans here and here. And we have a vapor chamber uh, cooling system. We have a DDR5, I think 6400. Uh, memories. So to replace the SSD on this one, you need to remove the heatsink first. There are one, two, three, four screws and take it off. You can replace the SSD and then put a new SSD. And for the rest of the SSDs, you just need to unscrew one, one screw up for each. This one, I think you have to use your uh, hand or prying tool to take it off and then you can add more memory. I heard they have four slots in total. For any questions, leave in the comment section. I'll do my best to answer your questions. Thank you for watching.